everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a first impression for you guys, and I picked up a couple th new things from the drugstore, so I decided to do um, a couple reviews for you guys. So on my channel, you'll be seeing a couple reviews back to back. I'm going to go ahead and get started with the first impression. You guys are probably wondering what I'm going to be doing a first impression on today, and I'm going to be doing a first impression on the new Wet n Wild Coverall Press Powder and Cream Foundation. I picked these up at my Walgreens, I believe. This one, the powder was $2.99 and this one was $3.99. I actually got this at Kmart, I remember. I got the powder at uh, Walgreens, I got the foundation at Kmart. But the price really doesn't matter because the price is going to be the same anywhere you go. Um, but these are new products. I decided to try them out because Wet n Wild hasn't had any new products in a very long time. So I'm really excited to review these for you guys and do a first impression. And if you guys are interested in seeing the video on this and how it works and how I like it, then go ahead and keep watching this video. Before I start this first impression, I want to read off to you what the actual product says it claims to do. And I'm going to apply it and see if what it claims is true. So the um, Wet n Wild Cover All Cream Foundation claims to wear all day. It has claims to be medium to full coverage, lightweight satin matte finish. It claims to have Visibrite Complex, which reduces the appearance of wrinkles and rejuvenates skin. Um, so those are all the things that it claims to do, and I'm just going to go ahead and apply I'm just going to be squeezing it out onto the brush. And it seems like a very, very, very creamy foundation. So, um, this is the before. Um, I do have acne, redness, um, I do have um, under eye circles, and just a lot of stuff. Um, so my skin isn't perfect at all, so I'm just going to go ahead and start applying this. So I'm done buffing in the foundation, um, and I think it has set for a little while. So I'm just going to show you the finished product. This is what it looks like. Um, I can definitely tell a difference in my skin. I believe this um, foundation is a medium to full coverage foundation, as it claims it to be. It feel like really, really um, heavy. Um, it just gives me a nice, flawless finish. It does give me a matte look. You see a lot of my redness gone, um, the majority of it. My dark circles are a little bit um, brighter. Overall, I think this is a really, really good foundation, and I would definitely recommend it. So now moving on to the powder, I'm going to be opening this up. And this is a pretty big powder. Um, I thought it was going to be probably half of the size that it actually is. So I'm really impressed with that for only $2.99. It does come with a nice sponge applicator, which I'm not going to be using because I don't really prefer the sponge applicator. That's what it looks like, and I did get the color light medium, and also I didn't tell you guys, but I got the um, foundation in light, um, just so that I would be safe and get a lighter color instead of a darker color. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply this and see how it works. to my face. Overall, I really think this is a good powder. doesn't leave my skin looking cakey or flaky at all, especially because I do have dry skin. Um, sets my under eyes pretty well. Um, even though I did not apply concealer, it still sets the foundation well. Um, I really like it. didn't give me that much more coverage. Um, so I think this is more of like a light setting powder just to give you a little tiny bit more color, but not like an extreme amount of coverage. So um, I really like it as a setting powder, not too cakey at all, we'll just set your makeup and make it last um, longer. Um, I, I do like it, looks good, um, again not cakey which is the biggest um, part of a powder is worrying about being, it being cakey which it wasn't. So I'm really, really, really impressed with both of these products. I really do like both of them. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed this review. Don't forget to check out these products. Um, and tell me how you like them when you try them out. Um, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video, and I will talk to you guys later.